Hello guys and welcome back. Today I have a very very beautiful car with me here, the new Audi RS5 Sportback uh, 2019. It's right here and it's gorgeous. One of the most beautiful car on the market today. Uh, this is kind of the rival of Mercedes uh, CLA uh, Coupe and both car look fabulous. It's really beautiful, also a, break, a great competitor for BMW 3 Series. So those three cars, I have it on my channel. Uh, if you didn't see the other video with the uh, Mercedes CLA and uh, BMW 3 Series, you can check out on my channel. You can see the videos there and you can make a comparison between these three cars. Uh, let's start with the exterior. I will review interior, exterior, and I try to show you everything. I love the fact that they put this glossy plastic around the edges of the windows. It looks so nice, this black glossy uh, thing around the windows. I really like it. I really like the, the design of the car around the lines, the shapes uh, right here look very beautiful. And uh, in my opinion, um, all three cars are very beautiful. Down here we have the same glossy plastic uh, black that look nice and the lines look really beautiful. Uh, in my opinion, all three cars look great, but the difference uh, from outside, they all look very nice and very beautiful from outside. The difference will be inside. I like this handle. Look how cool they open. They also have an LED light there in the handle uh, the the brake caliper the rims they are gorgeous uh, in my opinion they look perfect they are most the most beautiful also the front grille the lines on the hood there the new led technology uh, all that uh, you can see the daylight uh, led we have adaptive led lights in the front even the fog lamps are there here we have the radar in the front for adaptive cruise control and all that new technology also on the other side the same uh, on this car we have all black uh, also quadro uh, there in the middle parking sensors six parking sensors in the front uh, as well you can see it one else on the grill rs5 logo and the grill it's in black glossy it's look gorgeous really beautiful car I really like this car um, it's really nice design from exterior I don't know really I don't know um, which car can you choose uh, when you have a choice like that between these three um, designers it's it's really hard to choose but probably yeah here's some information about the the car the engine you can pause the video if you want to read this technical detail um, and here the consumption it's around nine uh, liter and um, yeah it's normal for such a powerful car uh, the consumption it's totally normal the car look gorgeous really beautiful and even in the back here with these LED lamps uh, the car look fantastic look at the lines look at every single detail uh, around this car look fabulous uh, from the side as well this little spoiler up here look pretty interesting and nice make the car uh, look uh, fabulous anyway um, yeah going forward in the back we have two exhaust pipe you can see it down there we have camera back camera led lights on the numbers plate rs5 logo there down here we have the sensors six sensors in the back the exhaust pipe down here a real one they look really nice and also the air diffuser down there look fantastic in the middle help the car having a better better handling on the on the road uh, really really um, beautiful I'm really curious about you guys uh, there here we have also the brake light up here uh, it's really really tiny you can see all over the the windshield the, there up there on the uh, window 
and when you break its its lighting uh, and it's look gorgeous. I'm curious what car would you choice? This RS5, a new Mercedes CLA or BMW 3 Series. Uh, check out the other videos and then comment here in this video. I'm really curious which one would you choice. In my opinion, uh, I think after we see the interior at the end of the, this video, I will tell you uh, which car I will choose. Here we have great aluminum. This is really beautiful um, and really useful when you want to load something in your car, not scratching there. Uh, also, we have a lot of hooks, big, big place here in the trunk, also on the side. Um, I like that it's really big, this trunk. Uh, and also under here, we have some uh, some small place. Uh, it's a battery, but you can put there something like small stuff. Anyway, I like the free seats. There are individual, so you can also uh, leave it down without any problem. And I will show you this in a moment. Uh, right now, I like the windows, the way they they made it without frame. They look really beautiful. Uh, soft materials on the door, nice uh, nice design here as well. Also the new handles, 2019 and also an LED light there on the handle. Alcantara leather here and also the normal leather here with red stitches. The button with chrome, uh, the speaker are uh, great, great quality bang. Uh, Olufsen and also LED light with uh, storage space there for a bottle or wherever you want to put. The seats look fabulous. We have on the side here also leather and even the seat belt look fabulous and nice. Uh, now the seats are red with red insertion stitches uh, in the middle. You can see the design is really pretty nice. Sport seats in the front, uh, back of the seats are with plastic. And a storage space there to protect the seat. Here in the middle we have 12 volt port, uh, heated seat. Here in the back we have great feature and also two vents. Uh, pretty, pretty good quality. Also armrest here in the middle with two cup holders. I will show you in a moment. Here you have a space for your handy or wherever you want to put there. Um, this is pretty useful. I really like this space here, where you, where you can put your 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 things. Oh, and by the way, I want to show you the um, the cup holders here. They have also two cup holders. You have to pull it out, so you can put your drink here. Uh, and it's pretty interesting the way they design it. Anyway, um, let's lift down the seat and show you how much space you have here. Because you have a lot of space in the in the car and it's also flat. It is a flat trunk, something that it's quite quite useful. You can load uh, plenty of stuff. So in comparison with the free series and CLA, um, this Audi have much much more space inside. Also we have LED lights here in the trunk uh, that illuminate from both sides and make the car look gorgeous so the trunk uh, because it's a hatchback it's much more space inside this new rs5 uh, even if the the size of the car is similar in this uh, rs5 you have much much more space uh, in the trunk than in the other cars uh, the, 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 the legs space it's okay uh, even i can put a little bit the seat the, the legs a little bit in the front so I feel like I have good comfort in the back hooks. I have up here the great, great quality on the roof. Nice design. Even here we have LED lamps uh, up here on the roof. Uh, we have a glass roof there in the front, kind of small. I prefer the, the cars that have glass all over the roof. And also on my head, I have a lot of space. And I, I have a great position here in the back great great comfort and also good visibility on the windows you can also see it's big big windows 
with great visibility. Now going in the middle, it's really hard, but once I go there, I have um, a lot of space on my on my legs and also uh, in my head. It's kind of one finger. I can I I think for tall people here it's a big big problem. Uh, but if I go a little bit in the front, then it's better, and I can sit here. Okay, three people here for short distances. It's no problem, but for long, it will be a problem here in the back. So uh, BMW 3 Series and CLA uh, Mercedes have much more space in the back uh, for the people. But anyway, going in the front, the dashboard uh, look fabulous. Also the steering wheel, it's, it's beautiful uh, and nice. And we will go right now there to see it. And it's a nice car with great quality, great exterior, and nice um, design. I like also these handles. So, the front door, it's also similar like in the back door. Great quality everywhere, Alcantara, soft material up here. We have also the buttons. We have electric seats with saving position. Handle here, it's different like the new Audis. Also, we have an LED there in the handle, Alcantara, great leather with red stitches speaker there. Also, the buttons are nice with chrome. You can see it, they look very nice. Uh, also, here we have the button for the trunk, the great speakers. Also, an LED there uh, where we have the, the space for a bottle. Down here we have again this LED that illuminate Audi Sports. Uh, on the floor we have RS5 here with LED illuminated, pretty nice. And also electric seats with all kind of position, uh, adjustable in every position you want. And also the button uh, for the lumbar part and all that stuff. They have side support, they are all full leather with red insertion uh, and it's look really nice this the way they design it also rs logo and up you can see they are sport sport seats um, and they look nice even the seat belt the same like in the back with red insertion on the side even the carpet have rs on them uh, aluminium pedals also a space here for your stuff uh, you can put your stuff here it's really long space here. I think you can put long items there too. We have great quality on the dashboard. Something that look like a carbon fiber or something like that, but it's not glossy. Here we have the light. You already know from Audi the light button. Also going inside. First thing I see is this beautiful steering wheel in Alcantara. We have soft material on the dashboard, the head-up display there. Um, the, the, the steering wheel is gorgeous, really gorgeous. It's full Alcantara. It's also have this RS on it. And it's gorgeous. I wish I had this. It's great grip, great quality. Nice steering wheel. Great job, Audi. Also, the buttons, the clappers here on the side. Uh, they are great quality, even here for navigation and the controllers on the steering wheel. Uh, they look very nice and cool. Look how beautiful is this steering wheel. Really beautiful. Really nice. Also, um, up there I already show you a simple model. Here we have um, a screen. I wish it was a little bit down, like a newer car, like I see on the, the new A1. But uh, the dashboard, it's simple. Uh, it's more simple and nice and the quality is good. Here we have the start-stop button. Um, also, we have the climatic system there in the middle. We have the new digital screen display there uh, in the middle with different functions. I will show you in a moment. Down here we have a 12-volt port, USB port uh, as well. And this thing for smoking, where you can take it out. We have an LED ambient light there uh, on the side here. 
also the controller for the display we have alcantara even here on the side great quality with alcantara and red stitches uh, in the middle controller for the infotainment system this is pretty good one of the best in the market and very easy to use it while you're driving uh, i have it on my car and it's it's fantastic it's really easy to use it while you're driving also here changing the gear rs logo on the gear shifter uh, handbrake electric handbrake and here i guess it must be the auto hold uh, also here we have the volume adjustable uh, wheel and some some design the same like on the dashboard um, quadro logo here on the dashboard the vents are simple uh, and nice i like the design of the dashboard it's simple and clean also here we have a lot of space even there up there we have the infotainment system the, the card slot for sim and all that other stuff we have a speaker on the a pillar great quality as well this a pillar look nice here we have the mirror uh, with an led light up there and in the middle here also we have the lights uh, led lights everywhere and also the controller for this nice uh, glass roof the visibility in the back it's great um, and also you can see it from here the back seat here we have an armrest that you can adjust it the way you want it leather also you can charge your phone 12 volt port again usb port auxiliar there for the people that still use that and here is the climatic system the heating seat button and it's quite nice it looks really nice and also the button driving mode and all that parking sensors and all that stuff anyway that was my review guys really short review with this new rs5 interior exterior i hope you enjoy the video um and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel check out also my other videos i have a lot of new cars the new mercedes cla and also uh here we have the blind spot on the mirror it's just i want to show you the new bmw 3 series and all other cars so thank you for watching my channel guys please subscribe to my channel um and uh, don't forget to come back for the uh, new reviews so thank you again and see you soon guys